Today, I'm going to be telling 100 lies and trying not to get caught. My mom is going to be so disappointed in me. What is going on, TFG squad? My name is Brandon, and welcome to the perfect lie. We are getting thrown right into this game. So basically, this is a game about a kid who just can't tell the truth. No matter what he does, he has to lie. So here we go. I got a zero out of a 100 on my exam. That's hard to do. I mean, you could you could guess and at least get a couple questions right. So this is this kid is actually so smart that he got a zero out of 100. I like <laughs> my two options are just tear it and burn it. None of the options even give me the choice of telling the truth. All right, well, we have to burn it, right? I have to burn it. Where is he? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So he's going to set his house on fire to protect himself from his parents. Oh, here Son, we go. Did you get your exam results? There's voice acting in this game. I mean, I guess it's not really voice acting. It was like a it was like a computer Siri voice, but I'll count it. That's more than most of these crazy mobile games. All right. So basically she asked me, did you get your exam results back? Now I really have to lie. Not only did I just set the thing on fire and almost burn down my house, I have to tell her that I didn't get it yet. We will get it next week. Yes, I got 100%. Okay. Once again, this game doesn't even give you the choice of telling the truth. You have to lie. It's just a matter of which lie are you going to go with. I want my mom to be happy with me, so I'm going to tell her I got a 100%, which is the exact opposite of what I did. Keep in mind, I didn't get one right. There were a hundred questions on the test. I got zero of them right. I'm going to go with a hundred. Yes, yes, I got 100%. <laughs> Great job, son. I love this. I love the voice acting in this game. Again, can I call it voice acting? <laughs> okay, that was the creepiest laugh ever. What is that, the tooth fairy? I saw you lie to your mom. I curse you. Every time you lie, your nose will get longer. What am I, Pinocchio? Every time I get... What? Okay, uh, lady, fairy girl, Um, you look like a nice fairy. I can't afford for my nose to get any bigger than it already is. My nose already looks like I have a compulsive lying problem. I, I can't afford to have any more distance on this thing. I'm going to just run into doors every time. Oh, my gosh. All right, so basically I can either say, OMG, what? Or how do I remove the curse? I want to know, how do I remove the curse? How do I remove the curse? Yeah, good question. Become the world's best liar, and your curse will be removed. Wait a second. So you're cursing me because I'm lying, but the way that I reverse the curse is by becoming a better liar? That doesn't really make any sense. All right. Okay, I will do it. Okay, I will do it. I don't want a long nose. I will meet you soon to check your progress. Thank you, lying fairy. I'm a newbie liar right now. Oh, that this is that was all the introduction. All right, now we're actually jumping into the game. I got an advertisement. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Kids are sneaking out the window. Oh, now I got to do it too. I got to do it too. Well, no wonder why I got a 0% on my exam. I keep sneaking out of class. All right, here we go. Jump. Jump. Fantastic. The the lying fairy will be so proud of me. It's like the tooth fairy, but for lying people. All right, so I've got a teacher. Why did you miss school yesterday? Um, because I climbed out the window. It's your fault for not seeing me. You know what? I think that should be a rule. If you can successfully climb out of your classroom without the teacher seeing you, you shouldn't be able, uh, you shouldn't be allowed to get in trouble. Actually, that's a terrible rule. That's probably the worst rule I've ever come up with in my life. So just take what I just said and ignore it. All right, here we go. I thought it was Sunday. My aunt passed away. Oh my gosh. I'm not going to go that extreme. What? I'm just going to say I thought it was Sunday. I thought it was Sunday. Yeah. Okay, please sit down. Did that work? Wow, this teacher's dumb. Here we go. It looks like we're taking an exam. Tap to hold to cheat? How do I... Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh! Oh, I see. So I can't get caught by the teacher. Oh! Uh-oh. Uh oh, I think I got caught. Oh no, I think I got caught. Uh, Why do you both have the same answers? It's not my fault. We studied together. He cheated from me. I'm going to blame the guy. Oh, that's a brilliant move. Cheat off of the guy and then blame him for cheating on me. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. That's what he I'm going to do. from me. Oh no. <laughs> Imagine if that was the reaction your teachers had if you cheated. They just scream at your face. Nobody would ever cheat again. Look at my nose. You can see th my the progress bar in this game is just your nose getting longer. I love it. Whoa, there's a leaderboard. I am now the 981st best liar in the world. Well, here we go. He's been 
Bunking school lately? What does that mean? Skipping school, I guess? Escape? Say you're sorry. Yeah, this is this is lying simulator, not telling the truth and apologizing simulator. Run away, my friend. What should I name this guy? Oh, good move. Between the legs, I like it. Hold to run. Oh, am I trying to run? Get out of my way, dog. I found a stray dog. Take it as a pet. Oh, I'd like a pet. Let him starve. No, I'm going to take him as a pet. All right, now I got a pet dog. Why does this say plus five months? What does that mean? Oh, now I'm 5.4 years old. I'm five years old. Oh my gosh. I'm the worst five-year-old ever. I am five years old and, and I'm a compulsive liar. This is not good. Hey, I can skip ads over here. How much money is it? $2.99. All right, fine. Wait, so there's levels in this game? Oh my gosh. Wait, how late can I go? 33? I can make this kid older than I am. And there's like a closet? Okay, so I can unlock clothes. I can change my hair. I could get new wheels. I could get like a car. Wow. Okay, that's cool. Let's get started and let's make that fairy happy. Swipe down to move the chair. Oh, man. This is a classic. This is a classic. You know, one of my friends did this to one of my other friends and he actually really hurt his tailbone. Couldn't walk for a week. All right, here we go. Move the chair. Kid's gonna try to sit down. Bam! Oh, it's a classic move. Don't do that. It's very mean, and you could hit your head on the back of the chair, and it's actually very dangerous. Oh, this kid wants to fight me now. Wait, it was my friend? I did that to my friend? I mean, I, I guess I literally just told you the story about my one friend doing it to my other friend, so I guess friends do that to me. All right, why did you move my chair? The chair legs are broken. There was a roach on it. Um, I, I, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna say there was a roach. I there saved you from it. roaches. Huh? Okay, well done. I got $100 for lying. Hey, and now I'm a rookie storyteller. Wow, and my nose is getting bigger. Oh my gosh, this is too good. Hey, the fairy's back. Hello, fairy. And uh, I'm now 5.8 years old. Oh my gosh, there was a fight going on. Bullies are beating up your friend. Please save me. I can either protect him or run away. Well, I just paid $2.99 so I don't have to watch advertisements. And if I'm going to protect this kid, I have to watch an advertisement. Sorry, friend. I'm running away. <laughs> this is the worst move ever. This is the worst move ever. I feel like I'm N from Alphabet Lord just being a coward. All right, here we go. What is this? I could get a new hairstyle? No, I like my current hairstyle. Okay, let's keep moving on. Let's go to the next level. Plus two months. So now I'm, am I going to be six years old? Am I, I'm six years old. All right. Now it's slightly less weird to be a compulsive liar, but still very weird. What's this hideout? Oh, is that a lemon tree? That is like the world's biggest lemon in the world. Okay. So I could spend a hundred dollars. I have 300. All right. I, I'm going to get a new home. Oh, I thought it was going to be like a new tree house. Level two. Oh, I'm building the treehouse. All right, by the end of this video, I want a beautiful treehouse. All right, here we go. Next lie. How was your exam? It was great. Are these guys twins? All right, I like them. I'm going to name them John and, 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 and Bon. I don't think I've ever met a guy named Bon before, but we're going to stick with it. All right. I will surely fail. I could have been better. Neither one of these are a great lie. Look at my nose, by the way. It's every single lie. It is getting longer and longer. All right, surely I will fail. I'll just say that. I will surely fail. Give us $100 and we will help you in next exam. What? I don't even have $100. I just spent it all on half of a tree house. I'll negotiate with them. I'll say I can only uh, I can only give you $25. I can only give $25. Don't beat me up. Deal. Whoa. Hey, look at that. Not only am I a liar, I'm a good negotiator. Getting money. Oh, no. I need to steal money from my mom. Here we go, mom. Money. Why do you need it? Oh, no. For a school project to buy food? I'm going to tell her. Um, I'm going to tell her it's for a school project because I feel like if I say to buy food, she's just going to be like, I'll go to the grocery store. What do you need? And then I'm completely out of luck. So I'm going to say it's for a school project. For a school project. Look at that. It worked. I'm too good at this, by the way. I am way too good of a liar. It's starting to make me concerned. Okay, let's continue on. And I am now the 924th best liar in the world. I didn't know they had a world ranking for liars, but it's kind of concerning. I think I have enough money to upgrade my tree house to level... Th oh, I have to watch an ad for level three. All right, well, I've made it this far. Let's do it. Oh, all of that and all I got was a desk for my tree house? That's disappointing. All right, here we go. Next lie... I'm playing on my phone. Here comes dad. Stop playing games. You are grounded for a week. That seems extreme. 
I'm grounded for a week just for playing a video game? Oh, I'd be grounded my entire life! Here we go. Dad's checking on me. Bottle of water or bucket? Do I really want to watch an ad and jump a and dump a But You know what? I hate advertisements so much. I'm going with the bottle. Oh, it's still going to dump water on him. That's still good. What the? Oh, I didn't think I was going to hit him in the head with the bucket. I thought I was going to dump the bucket of water on him. What is this? Glue or hammer? I don't even know what I'm doing. I am I going to glue him to the wall? I'm going to hit glue. Oh, no, I'm going to glue him to the- I'm going to glue him to the, the light switch! Huh? Dad is now stuck to the wall! Oh, this is embarrassing. Oh! That's gotta hurt. And my nose got even longer than it was before. All right, I'm now seven years old, and I am- Oh, my gosh, I'm going to pee in the pool. I- Oh, my gosh, I just peed in the pool, and now it looks like my sister's coming out for a swim- this is Did embarrassing. Did you just pee inside the pool? No, I didn't pee in the pool. The dye of my swim trunks are leaking. I didn't do it. Okay, I didn't do it. Has got to be the worst lie ever. I mean, you are the only one in the pool and you're surrounded by pee. What are you going to blame? Like, are you going to blame the water for peeing itself? That doesn't make any sense. I'm going to use the dye of my trunks. The dye of my trunks are leaking. Yeah. Oh. I am so sorry to hear that. My bathing suit's not even yellow. And I am now the 886th best liar in the world. Let me know if you want to see more of this game. Also, check out my other YouTube channel. It's called TFG Vlogs. And I will see all of you in the next video.